Welcome to the League of Legends Champion Spotlight, featuring Needley, the bestial huntress. They will fear the wild. Needley is a fully hybrid champion. She can play as a long-ranged mage, short-range assassin, tanky upfront fighter, or anything in between. Knowing how to take advantage of both her human and cougar forms are vital for success. Needley's passive is Prowl. While Needley moves through brush, she gains bonus movement speed. Needley retains this speed for a few seconds after exiting the brush. Let's start with Needley's ultimate, Aspect of the Cougar. Once learned at level 6 or higher, Needley may freely switch between human form and cougar form, offering three distinct abilities in each form. While in cougar form, Needley enjoys bonus armor, magic resist, and movement speed. Also, the power of Needley's cougar form abilities is controlled by the rank of her ultimate, while the human form abilities are improved by ranking up the abilities themselves. First, let's look at Needley's human form abilities. Javelin Toss throws a javelin in a straight line, damaging the first enemy it hits. Javelin Toss deals increased damage the farther it travels. I recommend one point in Javelin Toss early and maxing it by level 9 or 13. Bushwhack lays a trap on the ground for a few minutes that springs on the first enemy who walks over it. Enemies hit by Bushwhack take damage and are debuffed for the next few seconds, revealing them and reducing their armor and magic resist. I recommend taking Bushwhack at level 1 to scout the opposition, but maxing it last in favor of her other abilities. Primal Surge heals target ally and increases their attack speed for a few seconds. I recommend taking Primal Surge early and maxing it by level 9 or 13. Now let's check out Needley's Cougar form abilities. Takedown causes Needley's next basic attack to deal bonus damage, dealing even further damage based upon how injured her target is. Pounce sends Needley forward a short distance, dealing damage to all surrounding enemies when she lands. Swipe immediately claws the air in front of her, damaging nearby enemies. At the beginning of the game, Needley should learn Bushwhack and place them in major choke points. For example, this ramp holds a common jungle exit for the mid lane, while traps in this brush will help Needley spot ganks in the top lane. In early laning, constantly poke at your opponent, especially in the top lane. Walk into the brush to gain movement speed with Prowl, attack from outside the brush, and then walk back in to disappear from enemy minions. If you attack from inside the brush, you'll reveal yourself. Needley can output a ton of damage immediately after hitting level 6 for Cougar Form. After Master Yi heads in with Alpha Strike, swipe into Pounce and Takedown drop him dangerously low. Cougar Form runs faster than Human Form, and Pounce is free. Because of this, always head across the map in Cougar Form while spamming Pounce. And if you have Tear of the Goddess, it will charge incredibly quickly this way. Remember that Pounce can be used to leap over small walls, but always keep track of the cooldown. After Needly and Lux take down Kale, she turns to get back to her side of the map. However, Bran flashes over the wall to chase her down. Needly pounces away and then heads for the wall by Golems. Note that Needly saves the pounce cooldown until she gets to the wall, hopping over it and heading for the Baron Pit. She pounces over that wall and out of the fight. One of the easiest ways to land Javelin Toss is to stand behind walls or cliffs and throw the Javelins from there. Usually, your opponents won't have enough time to react, netting you a lot of free damage. When played as a squishy mage, only attack when there are opportunities. Ari fails to sit behind her minions, so Needly brings her to half health. Bushwhack spots a Mumu coming in for a gank, allowing her to pounce away to safety. However, Needly is safe from this range. She lands an easy javelin toss onto a Mumu and turns on the pressure. Switch into cougar form, flash, pounce, and take down, pick up a kill. Turn into Ari, swipe brings her low. Pounce hits again, and in human form, Primal Surge ensures Ari won't take a kill. Ari narrowly dodges a javelin toss as Needly wins a 2 vs 1. Because Needly has exceptionally high mobility, she can often bait her opponents into bad situations. As Jax and Kale chase down Needly, she makes a break for the brush and heads down to the golems. Needly pounces over the wall and heads straight into Bran. Pouncing back to the left, she's chased by three enemies. They turn to fight Draven, so she sends out a javelin toss before retreating as they turn back. Lux fires in to take out Kale, and Needly continues to run. Trying to remain in cougar form, she pounces away. While Jax does catch up, he doesn't have the damage to take her down. Once Jax turns around, Needly throws some damage back. Together, Needly's team takes three kills with no deaths. Needly should always be on the run, trying to land long-range javelin tosses and staying out of range. Javelin toss hurts Kale as Needly pounces away. Bushwhack makes tracking her victim easy as a second javelin toss picks up her first kill. From here, Needly tries to stay at a medium distance, able to spot her foes but not take too much damage until her team arrives. Needly heads in with her team, dodging Jax's Counter-Strike with Pounce. 
Now at a distance, Javelin Toss puts in some extra damage before Needly closes back in. After healing Lee Sin with Primal Surge, she returns to Cougar form, attacking Jax with Takedown and flashing over the wall for the kill with Swipe. Team fights with a tankier build will often have Needly running into the front lines. Needly splits from her team, dodging Sona's crescendo. Then she dives in looking for a kill with Pounce and Takedown. Needly's primary goal should be to kill squishy high priority targets like Draven, so she heads in, dropping him low in Cougar form. With Remus' help, Pounce, Swipe, and Basic Attacks pick off Draven before Takedown kills Kale. Needly then turns her attention to Sona. She chases with Pounce, constantly dealing damage and keeping up. After Takedown, she switches to Human Form. A Basic Attack and Javelin Toss score the triple kill. There are two example Needly builds I'd like to highlight, but as always, find what works best for you. For a melee-focused fighter, take Attack Damage Marks, Armor Seals, Magic Resist Glyphs, and Attack Damage Quintessences. Add onto this with 921 Zero Masteries, taking armor penetration in offense, plus durability and crowd control reduction in defense. For a long-ranged mage, take Magic Penetration Marks, Scaling Ability Power Seals, Scaling Ability Power Glyphs, and Ability Power Quintessences. Include 2109 Masteries, focusing on magic damage in offense, plus mana regeneration and neutral buff duration in utility. In either build, take Ignite and Flash for summoner spells, allowing you to safely skirt around the back or dive in for a quick kill. Thanks for tuning in to the Needly Champion Spotlight. Please subscribe to the Riot Games YouTube channel above and leave us your comments just below the video.